The terrestrial laser scanner is a geocollection instrument for geodetic imaging. TLS emits a pulse of light and calculates return time hundreds of thousands of times per second to generate a point cloud. With the addition of a high definition camera, users can assign a color value to each of the captured data points. These advancements and more allow researchers to capture high resolution point clouds from locations and on scales which were excessively difficult to study before the TLS. A typical scan will require the tripod, the scanner itself, a power source, usually a battery or generator, a computer with scanner acquisition software, and the optional camera mounted accessory. If your project involves geo-referencing data, the GPS with its own power source will be required. Altogether, the gear usually weighs around 100 pounds and can add up to over 300. Once you have identified the field site and confirmed logistics for access, you should determine the time to complete the survey. Before the scanning begins, it is important to walk around the site and determine the best vantage point for scanner, reflectors, and GPS base station, as well as a plan for how you are going to move around the location to best capture its different facets. Remember, it will usually take an hour or two to set up equipment and plan your survey once you have reached the scanning location and before the scanning process begins, especially if you plan on using reflective targets. If using reflectors, you should begin setting them up on their tripods at the predetermined locations. Next, begin GPS occupation of targets, which takes 20 to 30 minutes per target. During this time, you may begin scanning. You will generally want to perform a minimum of three scans, with most projects averaging about six. If necessary, 100 or more may be performed over multiple days. To tell in the field that the scan was successful, you may compile the scans in your scanning acquisition software as they are captured by the scanner. Once the project has been entirely processed, the data, data products, and their important project materials will appear on UNAVCO's publicly available database. UNAVCO provides aligned, georeferenced point clouds. PIs will then derive the higher level products from that point cloud as the study requires. A suite of software licensing is available to UNAVCO-supported products. Go to UNAVCO webpages to learn more.